NASA has never named a spacecraft after a researcher during their lifetime. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we're about to make history. It is my great honor, a few days before your 90th birthday, uh, Gene, to announce that we're renaming the Solar Probe Plus spacecraft to be known from now on as the Parker Solar Probe. Congratulations. <laughs> we want to go down there, take the challenge of going in the worst kind of thermal environment in the solar system, survive that because we built the machines robust enough to do that, measure the environment there and really prove and find uh, what the kind of heating processes really are that in fact make the corona hot. But I'm certainly greatly honored to be associated with such a heroic scientific space mission. By heroic, of course, I'm referring to the temperature, the thermal radiation from the sun, and the extreme measures developed to survive that radiation and collect scientific data should be fully appreciated. As a theoretician, I greatly admire the scientists and engineers whose patient efforts together converted the solar probe concept into a functioning reality ready to do battle with the solar elements as it divulges the secrets of the expanding corona. So, hooray for solar probe. Even hotter, 300 times hotter, facing the corona's brutal heat and radiation conditions, 